Mr. Wagner, on September 1st, 2018, CHG Meridian acquired the Australian uh, tech company Equi Group. Why? It will support us to keep our very great growth momentum that we currently have, or even will give us a boost on that. One need, need to know that this is the largest acquisition in the history of CHG Meridian, and it will help us to come very much closer to our medium-term planning target of 2 billion euros lease origination. What does that mean for the international presence of the CHG Meridian Group from now on? Also here we have a positive impact. Um, with the market entry in Australia and New Zealand, we're going to be present in total in 25 countries. So we are covering Europe, South America, North America, and from now onwards also Australia and New Zealand. How will the acquisition create growth momentum for the two companies in the future? Well, both companies, CHG Meridian and Equigroup, are specialists in technology management and technology financing. Both companies, therefore, have overlapping solution and technology portfolios, especially in the area of IT and healthcare technologies. Equigroup um, is active in seven countries and serves 1,500 customers. Customers, these are, for example, big multinationals, SME enterprises, or public organizations and companies. Equigroup is supporting them in the entire life cycle for technology investments. I think this is quite similar and familiar to us at CHG. Based on that, we're going to have a great growth potential um, by combining both companies. What will happen in the next few weeks and months in the cooperation in between Acri Group and the CHG Meridian Group? What's planned? Well, this differs uh, to the territories. Uh, for Australia and New Zealand, uh, the answer is quite simple. They're business as usual. Um, the Australian and the New Zealand team are going to continuously work on executing their successful strategy. The business model will be unchanged and there will be no further integration. This will be a standalone business unit by continuing what they do. On top of that, we try to get the low-hanging fruits. Uh, I see three areas where we have those. Uh, one in the funding area, there for refinancing, we could be uh, adding own book funding or other alternatives. Second, I think we can show greater flexibility uh, in respect to certain customer situations, especially in the healthcare area. And third, um, the international customers. I think we can serve them uh, in the short term and uh, serving both the Equity, uh, Equi Group's international customers and the CHG Meridian international customers. And what does that mean for the other uh, countries Equi Group operates today? Well, for the Nordics and for UK, we're going to compare the business models and we're going to show how we can integrate them structurally and from an organizational point of view uh, under one roof. Um, as a next step, we're going to aim for a one team and one location structure in each of these countries. So we will um, try to combine the offices. Um, at the end, we aim for a full integration in those countries. How about the branding of the company? What are the plans for that topic? Well, for the time being, we're going to stick to the name Equi Group. Uh, we will add the sentence uh, member uh, of the CHG group um, and this is how we're going to start. Then I wish you good luck for the next uh, weeks and month. Um, that's very interesting what's happening from now on. Thank you very much. I think it's uh, exciting times and it's a unique opportunity for us at CHG. Um, again, we have high expectations in regard to this acquisition um, and all the growth potential and the synergies I was mentioning they are all just on paper now. So now we have to turn this into a reality. And for this, it's going to be essential that there is good teamwork. Good teamwork between CHG Meridian and Equi Group. I'm very confident that we're going to be successful and looking forward to the great success. Mm -hmm.